To me. No sign of Wickman here. He may be hiding within the city walls. Shall we search? No. He'll be gone. Count on it. Argar coward. But we've struck a bold claim today. Walk with me. I want you to sound our battle horn to announce our victory. Let all the Shire know that Grandbridge is retaken. The sound of the horn means prosperity, long life, bounty. Why me? Why not? You were the keystone to this attack. You turned the tide. Let the wind from your lungs breathe life back into my city.
Ah. My clan throws the best feasts, I think you'll find. You enjoy yourself? I did. But were you celebrating? We're mourning. You looked unsure. The night of the attack, I heard sounds of bloodshed coming from the Longhouse. In moments, the city was overrun with Saxons, so I called a retreat. We all have our one day, but not like that. Not that day. I have heard this before, that the Saxons appeared as if from the shadows. In all my time in Grantbridge, this tunnel was my most careful project. The best kept secret in the city. Now a hundred or more Saxons know the smell of it. The only people who knew about this tunnel were me, and the three in my inner circle. You believe you were betrayed? I know I was. By whom? That is where I hesitate. Between Leif, Galen, and Birna, I cannot say. But they are the three who helped me dig this in secret. I hoped you might lend me your wits. You are a fresh ally. I could use your eyes and ears. I promised you I'd help secure your city. That task isn't yet done, it seems. Good. I sent Galen, Leif, and Birna to destroy what remains of Wigman's power throughout the Shire. Meet with them. Raid with them. Get to know them as best as you can. Find out which of them betrayed me. I'll do what I can, but you know your warriors far better than I do. Between you and me, my heart is clouded. I love these three as if we shared a womb. I need clear, sound judgment. I need you, Eivor. You have me. Thank you. Feel free to take a look around as you wish. Search the city, the tunnel, and here, a gift, for retaking Grand Bridge with us. One of the few things I have left from my blood family. The markets are up and running again, so it doesn't waste time.
Well met. Information. I have it. Do you need it? Well worth a little silver, I assure you. Yes, all right. Now, show me your map. There is a place... here. Nothing more to share for now. Soma has just cursed his bad luck. Soma has only ever pleased the gods. Deserting her now, breaking your oath, that is what will bring us ill luck. Eivor, I am honored you have joined us. What's your plan here? All the Shire support Soma's ruling the city. These hamlets do not. They're feeding and outfitting Wickman's army. So we will burn their homes, quick and devastating, like the thunderclaps of Thor. How did you come to be in Soma's clan? A vision from Evolva set me on this path. It pricked my mind like a splinter, then faded. But I wanted more. For months, years, I ate only henbane, mushrooms, sacred plants, hoping to see something new. But my body dwindled. I lived addled, maddened. A wanderer, taken in by Saxons and spat out, again and again, until Soma found me, naked and alone in the fence. She clothed and cared for me, humbled as I was. I owe her my life. Visions can be strange and powerful. What did you see? I was climbing a mountain, a lion and a snake upon my back, weighing me down. I struggled. And Soma appeared, and she eased my burden. When we reached the peak, there was hardly enough room to stand. On a point like the tip of a blade, we teetered there, gripping one another. Tightly. I know it can seem distant. Obsessed. But the gods are with us always. I see it as my duty to shelter Soma from their ire. What do you think of the others? Leif and Birna. Leif? He's a talented sailor, if a little enthusiastic. And Birna? Well, 
Bina thinks of life as a grand joke. She was a smuggler when Soma pulled her from the muck, making a living on lies. Bina is part of my clan, and I will fight beside her, irreverent as she is. But she has no care for her destiny. I am eager to start throwing torches. Now let's rid these hamlets of Wickman's rats. Light your torches and set your arrow tips ablaze, Abel. Red and your fans will make quick work of this place. <laughs> Need to cloak myself here. Are a curse visited upon them all. Leave no house unburned. This is what they get for helping Rand Grand Bridge from Soma. For licking Eldam and Wickman's boots. The smell of burning roof thatch and heady turf fire.
That was something. Wakeman is sure to take notice. You stamped and roared like a fiery Sutur himself, marching through the flames of Muspelheim. I'll see you back home, Drenga. Angel, my lord! Ich ondete Christus vor Jemenes. Achthaf, Wolf Heldu, Skulon vor Rodian, und Hel. You have lost your apples. But I have. Oh, a devilish wind took me over, and I worry for them. But I've saved the finest and the juiciest. Oh, these apples explode in your mouth with the iridescent light of Jesus. What makes them special? An apple is an apple, no? Oh, I beg to differ, my friend. You see, every year we make the pilgrimage to the west. Hammer's farm. Farmer Hammer, to the west. Yes, we call him the Hammer, and his apples are fine. Have this sweet iron tinge in them. My friends have already made it back. They are surely feasting already, but... I fell on some misfortune. My cart busted. Oh, me apple cart hath fallen! These apples must be eaten, they're too juicy to be left to rot! Wolf head don't be set on. Hey, one yath, one for head yath. It shall have lean on us on Drenan. Please send me an angel, my lord! It's on the day, Christus, for you and his. Oh, eternal thanks for carrying the crate. I'll be happy to share in the bounty of these apples with you, once we meet up with your friend. Oh, surely. We will share the Lord's work with you. The iron tinge, you will taste it. We all have earned it after fasting. Fasting? Is that when you lack food for your god? Yes, we show our devotion, remove distraction. But now, we give in to the fruits of our Creator's work. Sharing an apple with a friend is the most sublime experience. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it is nice to sometimes sit back and simply enjoy an apple. Well, with our fortune always changing in life, it's important to enjoy simple pleasures. <laughs> oh, I am so excited for you to see my friend and eat apples with us. 
the act of walking, the pilgrimage we're going on. We will prostrate ourselves for Guthlack at the end of this glorious pilgrimage, drown in his reward. Here we are, our tiny sanctuary. Join in prayer for the apples, if you like. We bob. Bob? It is the only way to piously reap the reward of our Holy Father. Praise be to him. Oh, Brother Holtwolf! And you've made a friend as well. Good to have you back. Better be hooded. Flank the idiot! Press hard! Watch my lead. 
That's all I have for now. Find me later. This land bears steep affliction. Thank <laughs> you. 
goes as much air as a hailstorm. You cannot be allowed to keep spewing. Did you sell through a store? Eivor! A fine day for being out, no? Soma said I would find you here, Leif. What's your plan? We're ridding the world of a priest who spouts praise for the Elderman and funnels tithes into Wickman's coffers. So the plan is this. We sneak in, gut the priest, and return to Soma. That will get Wickman steaming. How did you come to join Soma's army? We came to England together, sailing under Guthrum. The great summer army, the Saxons called us. When Guthrum left for Wessex, Soma stepped forward to lead. Something I would have liked to do myself. What would you do if you were the Jarl of Grandbridge? I would run the city in my own way. I would not give Birna and Galen's opinions equal weight. Do you not trust them? I wouldn't say that. It's more. Birna's boots are stuck in the mud, and Galen's are in the sky. If death were bearing down upon us, I worry neither would have what it takes to carry us through. You were there when Guthrun made Soma the steward of Grandbridge. How did that feel? Good fortune for her. When Soma took hold, the silver started flowing and the people started dancing. She knows trade. I do wish I'd been bold enough to put myself forward, to take on the burden and honor of running a city. But that's beside the point. Soma is my Jarl's corner, and I'm her sworn man. No act of any god will change that. As a master shipbuilder, what does your work require? Patience and love. I know each of our vessels as a parent knows their child. But building ships needs silver too. The hard wood, the tough fabrics, the expensive paints, the yellow I use, for instance, that must be imported. A high price for a happy color. I'm certain that's why someone stole my paint some weeks ago. Blasted thief. Good conversation, Leif. Now let's take down Wickman's men. Too right, too right. Wickman's whelp awaits his reward. My warriors will distract the Saxon forces at the gate. You and I will find the priest.
If they see me, this will get messy. Forward approach. But for you, I'll try something new. How kind. I'll keep your voice down. Let us lose! Guards! Help! Help! Weakman should have killed you all off the first time! if they 
spot me. <gasps> Well struck. We made short work of Wickman's man. That we did. You've proven yourself an asset to us. I see you back in Grand Bridge. gets longer, Watch the nails out, grow, even when the corpse... Eivor, my muscle-banded friend! There's a nest of Wigman's men just here. We're going to pick it clean. Every last one. The fewer lies in the bush, the less itchy the pussycat. That's how I see it. How did you come to join Soma's army? I'd been in England for ages before Guthrum, Ivar, Uppa... ...smuggling under the eyes of Saxons and Danes alike. I lied, stole, had my nose broken. Life wasn't easy, but it taught me how to bear the pain. I just laughed it away. When Soma took me in, she saw more than a smuggler in me. 
I was useful to something greater than myself. Useful to her vision. In a world where few saw you as worthy of trust, she's one who did. Right. And I love that about her. I love everything about her. You seem to bring life and spirit to this clan. Does Soma feel the same? If I knew what was going on in another person's head, I'd find life dreadful and dull. But Soma seems to enjoy my company. In what way? Her own way. Just not in the way I'd like. Painful truths are easy to bear when you can laugh, you see. Delight in the face of suffering is an act of rebellion. What do you think of Soma's other warriors? Galen and Leif? Oh, Leif's got that raw animal pull. Every time I see him, I want him to climb me like a tree and nest in my armpits. He brays about being honorable, but I've never met a man of honor who starts a fire just to be praised for putting it out. And Galen, he broods like it's an art form. He's got this self-importance that is just so charming. We could talk all day, but these Saxons may fly from their nest. You and I should take a closer look. My men will hang back and come running if things go sideways. Fighting beside you should bring a thrill. Happy I can see it up close. <laughs> Don't get too close. I might like your eye or bruise your head. <laughs> You'd lose your elbow before the bruises showed.
Snuff you out! 